Find the value of the integral from 0 to 1 of 1 over x squared plus 1 dx. We realize that x squared plus 1 matches the pattern x squared plus a squared. And because of that, that suggests that we should use a trigonometric substitution of x equals a times tangent theta. So, in this case, x is being squared to provide this x squared, and 1 squared is being able to squared being providing us 1. That means that a is 1 and x is x. So x equals 1 tangent theta should be the trigonometric substitution we should use in this problem. So if x equals 1 tangent theta, we'll also need a dx. So taking the derivative of both sides, dx uh, uh, of x is dx, derivative of tangent theta becomes secant squared theta d theta. We'll plug these two substitutions into the problem, and we'll leave off the limits until the very end when this is back in terms of an x. So this will become the integral of 1 over x is tangent, so tangent squared theta plus 1, and instead of dx, we'll change that to secant squared theta d theta. Using trig identities, we recall that tangent squared plus 1 is the identity for secant squared theta. Secant squared theta. And apparently, the secant squared thetas will cancel, leaving the integral of 1 d theta. Well, the antiderivative of 1 would become a theta. Derivative of theta would become 1, in other words. So our result so far is theta. To evaluate our integral, we need to turn this back in terms of x's. So if, and we'll write this in the second column here, if x equals tangent theta, applying an inverse tangent, this would become theta equals inverse tangent of x. So our result of our integral now becomes the integral from 0 to 1 of 1 over x squared plus 1 dx becomes inverse tangent of x evaluated from 0 to 1. Meaning first we'll plug in 1, inverse tangent of 1, minus inverse tangent of 0. Now in both cases, we're asking for what angle would tangent provide 1 or tangent would provide 0. In other words, tangent, in fact, we'll write this in red below this, tangent of what works out to 1, or tangent of what works out to 0. Well, from a unit circle, both values would have to be the same uh, point to work out to 1, and this does occur at pi over 4 from a unit circle, minus and tangent of what value would work out to 0? Well, that again would work out to 0. Tangent of 0 is 0. So, pi over 4 minus 0 is what this integral evaluates to, which results in pi over 4 as the answer.